Hey everybody, this is Hotspot Gaming One, and uh, in this video, I will be showing you how to install a Hero Brian mod for Minecraft 1.4.7. But honestly, guys, it is the exact same for every single Minecraft version in the future. So I say 1.4.7. If you comment saying like 1.4.7 is not the same as 1.3.2, bitch. I mean, it's not like you're gonna say that, but that's happened to me so many times. Like literally, those exact same words that I just said. But honestly, they they work exactly the same. So um, please don't hate just because it it says 1.4.7 or 1.5.1 maybe, and um, it will be fine. Like honestly. Okay, so uh, I'll give you the link in the description. You just scroll down. Well, um, then you keep scrolling down till you find the. Um, do you find the download? Okay, right here it says, um, use the installer. Okay, right here. Click here. So, um, I, I will give you the link in the description. And I will give the link that takes you to the actual Herobrine page. And you can try and download it if, if you're not on 1.4.7. But if you are, I'll give you just click on the direct 1.4.7 here brand mod easy installer thing. Okay, so I really do not like these, but um, download. I really don't like these uh, third-party websites. Just like really, they're just kind of awful. Okay, so free download. You have to wait 30 seconds, and I've never even been on this website, but why don't I just use Mediafire, honestly, it's just so much easier. And so, yeah, I'm sort of complaining about everything today, it's just sort of, uh, I didn't get a great sleep last night, and, uh, well, you don't want to know about that, like, honestly. It's, uh, like, the way that you have to get videos subscribed, if you, the way that you want to get subscribers and likes and stuff, do you want to think what your subscribers would want, or just people? It's like, you just type in this, um, it's not like they want to see how your day was. Well, they clicked on this video just to see how to install the here brand mod, or whatever mod it will be. And, um, okay, so you just type that in, press enter, and here brand mod is installing. So, but, guys, this... I mean, like I was saying, this is not really the, the best the best mod, but it still g can get views if if I make a good video, and that is just really all I have to say for that. Well, I'll come back when it is finished downloading. Thanks, guys. And guys, um, as you see, I'm back. It probably wasn't even any time for you, but for me, it was about five minutes. Okay, so you just uh, drag that onto your desktop. Then um. Let's shrink this. Double, double click on here, run mod, and like, like if you think this fishy is pretty cool. Yeah, right. Now, honestly, I find those posts on Facebook so fucking obnoxious. Like, honestly, it's like, like if you have a trampoline. It's like no one gives a shit if I have a trampoline. It's like all you do is just. I mean, it doesn't matter, but. It's just pissing me off. It pisses everyone off all the time. Okay, so you just want to go to the here learn my folder. And um, if you're on Windows, just double click on there. But if you are not, then just go with me. And then new finder window. And what you want to do is if you if you see your library, if you see your username, so it might be like a number. If you're on like a server computer, it might be um like your name obviously so my name is Jack Jake Thomas so um, it should be up here just but this computer is newer and some of them don't have it but if you if you cannot find your library that there, there's no way you can find it no matter what you can't search it any anywhere it's just extremely hard the only way you can find it is if you press shift command G all at the same time G is the button left of the spacebar shift everyone knows and G is G then what you want to do is type slash library press go application support and you go into sorry library application support minecraft 
and then when you're in Minecraft, what I would recommend you do, just because it helps, I uh, just scroll everything, get everything, and um, just un uncircle whatever you want to call it. Everything you want, so saves, mod, no texture packs, saves, options, last login servers, because you want your servers. It's just pretty. Then you want to just delete everything else that you don't that you know you don't want. Clean up by name, whatever. It doesn't really matter. Then you want to go back into your Minecraft. Force update. Now um, it should take about 30 seconds at the most. Uh, some computers take longer. My internet used to be awful, but now it's better. So it used to literally take like f seven minutes for just to finish this, but now it's better. It's taking about 15, 20 seconds. Okay, so it's done. Now when it's finished, you just want to exit out of your Minecraft and go into into Minecraft dot jar. Now, you, but now in Minecraft, you want to go into your bin. And right click on on Minecraft.jar and go to rename and uh, I don't usually do that anyway so you just click on it and press enter that's the easiest way is uh, Mac makes, makes it very easy so you just Minecraft.jar and do dot the zip exactly like that you zip this is probably the easiest way because then you just double click it and this only works for Mac, it just makes a new Minecraft.jar folder, which you can access that easily all the time. It's very good. So in and then in Minecraft.jar you drag everything. Apply to all, replace, you must do that. Apply, there we go. Then uh, into Minecraft. Um, you should, or it says don't Minecraft just because it's just there, sort of. So then you drag yeah. here, Brian, and you can just go into resources, drag resources into resources, drag resources into here, and then replace that resources for this, or just delete that and drag it in. But if you really want to make sure you don't lose anything, you just want to drag yeah. mod from this resource and resources into this <laughs> the other resources that I'm probably confusing you guys so much you just like uh so pa but you know just um these I'll try and get through this pretty quickly. Yeah, I'm probably already like ten minutes into the video. Okay so now you want to go back into Minecraft.jar and you want to find the folder everyone knows what it's called. It is just the most useless folder ever. Uh, you want to it's Range by kind, then you can find all the big, all these real folders, and then go. But there's a meta imp folder. I'm gonna delete everything from meta imp. Yeah. Then you wanna exit out of there, and let's go into our Minecraft. Okay, so, um, log in. Um, okay, so um, you see it it went on properly this part. So you just want to exit out of Minecraft again. Then you want to click the other link in the description called Resigami's Mods, and um, what you want to do is download Mod Loader just directly, just because it's faster, and then Audio Mod directly. And the, the, those will download extremely fast, so you just drag that there and that there. Then, um, just shrink that. Unzip them both. It's easy to use the unarchiver just because it is probably the best one that it was ever made, sort of, you know? So you, you can download it off the uh, App Store. And, um, so you just want to delete these now, but you can keep them if you want to use them again. But, um, go into your mod loader, find new finder window, go back into Minecraft. Let's go back to the beginning of the video if you want to find out how. But, you probably remember, most people do. Back into your bin, minecraft.jar, mod loader, drag everything into there, apply to all, replace. 
Are you mod? Then what you want to do is hinge by kind. You want to drag these two in here. Then you want to search up pulse code. So go into pulse code on uh, Minecraft.jar and pulse code on audio mod. Go into sound on both codecs and drag codec ibxm.class into sound. So um, now the installation should be complete. So um, as you see it didn't crash so obviously then it worked. So you just want to go into a world, it doesn't matter which one, I'm just going to go into the more explosive world so you can just see all the damage that I did in my old uh, mod review. It's checked out on my channel, I made that about five days ago, it's pretty good. This is just a couple nukes, you know, nothing too special. So you want to find a crafting table. Then you want to get soul sand and bone. Go inside, on soul sand in the middle. Oh, I forgot that. Okay, bone. <laughs> okay, bone everywhere except for in the very middle. Then get soul sand, put it right there. Hero Brian Totem. Then, um. Oh, look at that. And Hero Brian is in there. One sec, sorry. So. Oh, uh, that's pretty weird, isn't it? So, since we have that, you can just get rid of everything else. And what you want to do now is get gold blocks. And also get um, another rack. And last of all, flint and steel. So what you need to do is go like this. Too high. That there. That there. And that there. You don't know what you did. Okay, so now it, it is activated. The mod is 100% activated and, um, yeah. You should just wait and you will come. And what on earth is this? What on earth? <laughs> Skeletons are being homosexual. <laughs> okay, that sounds just retarded. Well, um, thank you for watching, guys, and I will see you next time on Hotspot Gaming 1 for any for useful tutorials and videos. So please just leave any video request or just concerns or questions about this mod. Or just anything. It could be any mod. Even a let's play. And um, just leave in the description of any of my videos and I will try and get to you as soon, back to you as soon as possible. Thanks for watching and goodbye.